Chapter 3, Nationalism in India. Q.3, Write a Newspaper Report on. A. The Julianwala Bogh Massacre. B. The Simon Commission. Ends. A. The Julianwala Bogh Massacre. A public meeting was announced for 13 April 1919, at Julianwala Bogh, Amritsar to protest against the Rowlett Act. The people were allowed to assemble there. After they had gathered there in thousands, General Dyer marched there with armored cars and troops. Without giving any warning to the people to disperse, he ordered firing on the unarmed and peaceful people. The casualties among the Indians were very heavy. Dyer's purpose in doing so was to produce a moral effect, to create in the minds of Satyagrahis a feeling of terror and awe. This massacre of innocent people in thousands converted Mahatma Gandhi into a non-cooperator. B. I. The Indian members of the Central Legislative Assembly exposed the drawbacks in the Government of India Act of 1919 AD as a result of it. The Simon Commission was appointed in 1927 AD to suggest any further constitutional reforms. This commission consisted of seven members and its chairman was Sir John Simon. E. Why was it boycotted by the Indians? But Indians boycotted the Simon Commission because there was no Indian member in this commission. The terms of the commission's appointment did not give any indication of Swaraj, while the demand of the Indians was only Swaraj. Therefore, the Indian National Congress, the Muslim League, and other parties decided to oppose the Simon Commission. E. Methods. Indian people organized hartles all over the country. They also held a black flag demonstration with the slogan, Simon go back, when the commission reached Bombay, Mumbai. Such demonstrations were held everywhere it went. Please like and subscribe this channel.